Hey, good afternoon, folks. I uh, wanted to kind of anyone that might be curious talk about how we've changed our operations so that we can continue to serve those folks that do want us to come out to their homes um, and businesses um, safely uh, while maintaining the guidelines that uh, our federal government and state government, Governor Cooper and our Governor Cooper and his uh, team has outlined. So we're still doing proposals, we're still doing estimates, but Jason or myself will not give you a paper estimate. We'll send you an emailed copy just as soon as we get back to our desk or truck or office. But no more paper estimates. We can still get out in the yard with you and walk your home or walk uh, your, your property, point out all the things that we can fix or make better or clean or improve upon. Uh, but we won't give you a paper estimate. We won't give you a flyer. We used to pass out tons of flyers in any neighborhood we were working in. So we cut that out and um, really not passing out business cards anymore either. Uh, if you find one on, gosh, a cash register, uh, but th that's not going to happen either because we placed them at so many restaurants that are now closed. So, yeah, nonetheless, no paper. Um, we used to pass out tons of these little pink prestige pressure wash pens um, not passing out any more of those either so just trying to stay within the rules and regulations and suggestions of the federal and state authorities uh, we had a meeting with the team on Monday um, talked about us as a team a group of six men uh, what we're doing to make sure that we're keeping each other safe that we're keeping our trucks um, sanitized safe uh, that that when we go home each evening we don't host a house party we don't go to food line two or three times we go home we spend time with our family and that's it I haven't even left the shop uh, except to go visit a guy that's doing some welding for us and still same you know no handshaking you know I stood on the other side of his yard we talked and uh, kind of in the business deal there so making smart decisions keeping each other safe, keeping our clients safe. Um, we're fortunate enough to be able to do what we do without having to be arm in arm with those that we're serving and arm in arm uh, with those that we're serving with. Likewise, we can still give bleach away to anyone that needs it. We've had a few folks um, take us up on that offer. Uh, but if you need a gallon of bleach, come see me and we'll be more than happy to stare six to 10 feet apart Shoot the bull for a few minutes and we'll get your bleach filled up and we'll send you on your way. So um, a small gallon, just a regular one gallon jug of our stuff, you can take and probably make uh, four to six regular strength gallons of bleach. And then likewise, you can take that, dilute it even further and make gosh, dozens of gallons of just an everyday cleaner. Um, don't know how well it works in HE washing machines. I've never done that. I still buy store-bought bleach to uh, do the whites on laundry day. Nonetheless, I'm rambling a little bit. Um, hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's staying safe. Um, we'll get to the back end of this. Uh, we're ready for you this summer. We're ready for life to get back to normal, too. If you want us to come out and serve you at your home, we can do that. We've got... Um, you know, a change in our standard our standard operating procedure on how we interact with clients that'll allow us to come serve you safely. Uh, we would need, though, that's one thing I forgot to mention, if we do come out to your home and serve you, we ask that you take uh, cushions, you know, you know, yesterday's pint glass or wine glass that might be on the back porch um, from your evening before, uh, an ashtray, anything personal. Um, you know, if you leave your ball cap, Hanging outside by the door, we're going to ask you to take that inside with you. Um, cushions for outdoor furniture, take those inside with you so that our guys um, are handling things that maybe you handled yesterday. All just trying to stay within the guidelines of the state and federal government. So if we can help, give us a call. We're still answering the phones. They aren't ringing like they normally are in April, but that's okay. We know everybody's struggling. If there's anything we can do for you, please don't reach. don't hesitate to reach out. Thanks, bye.